Alright, last trailer before launch, let's go. Oh, that looks like the guard mechanic, okay. Okay, we've seen this in the second trailer, I think, but this is an overview trailer, so let's see what they're they're talking about from Soft. Story, okay, I I need to be paying attention here. Armored Core 6 Fires of Rubicon is a sci-fi mech action game that takes Facts. place in a future where interstellar travel is common. On the blockaded planet Rubicon 3 in a distant star system. Okay, yeah, so Rubicon is the planet. You are an augmented human pilot, optimized to control a humanoid weapon referred to as an AC, or armored core. Yeah. Under the direction of its owner, Handler Walter, you find yourself as an independent mercenary in a war between forces over a new substance called Coral. Yes, in the last trailer I reacted to, uh, people commented that a good analogy for Coral would be Spice from Dune. Battle. Okay, so so they're giving us a lot, some gameplay mechanics. The AC is a weapon that can perform three-dimensional actions that humans cannot. <laughs> okay, facts. Can move freely between the ground and the air, and use up to four weapons simultaneously. Okay, simultaneously, yeah. Stagger is an important element to consider in battles between mechs. While dodging the enemy's attacks in three dimensions, continue to press the attack. Yeah, I've heard this is a direct hit. Take some inspiration from Sekiro. Control system is down. Yo, that's incredible. Assemble. Okay, so customization. I assume. Assembly allows you to customize your AC. Okay, this is gonna be insane. Incredible freedom in battle. Look at all these options. The durability too. and weight of the AC are determined by its frame parts. Leg parts in particular significantly change the Yeah, I think weight matters for movement speed. Bipedal legs excel in maneuverability. Reverse joint legs special jumping, yeah. jumping power. Tetrapod legs can stay in the air by hovering. And tank treads turn your Tank treads giga chad. Let me know in the comments who's going first play through tank. By assembling your AC with the right combination of weapons, it's possible to coordinate your attacks to cause enemies to stagger then follow up with a direct hit. Boom, a little Continue wombo combo. To optimize okay. Your AC by assembling inner parts that define its basic performance. The paint function Oh, this is so sick. Just a few hours. I can't wait. You've assembled. Set the coloring and texture, apply your own original decals, and create your one of a kind personalized AC. Then upload Damn, that looks your amazing. Data and share it with other players. Oh, nice. The mission, so like gameplay loop, maybe. With your completed AC, yeah. you can now sortie in various missions. Check the details to learn the request and reward. Then accomplish your mission by disabling Big Shadow of Colossus vibes. Eliminating hostile forces. Yeah. Recovering data and destroying facilities. Okay. So just some objectives, just some gameplay loop stuff. The key to success is to adjust your AC's assembly to fit your strategy. For sure. As you establish a track record, more requests will come your way. Let's get to work, shall we? Shall we? Rubicon's environment is full of threats. Mega structures that cover the surface of the planet. These environments are out terrain. of control. Remains from long ago. Oh, that's so and sick. Deep underground facilities. Oh, so underground Explore confirmed. Large scale sci fi world with your custom AC. The environment is not the only threat on Rubicon 3. Mm hmm. You'll encounter bosses oh my with God. abilities that surpass even those of ACs. Identify your enemy's behavior. Melee and boss? Okay. And optimize Dude, I thought that was like an 18 wheeler for a second. To defeat these it's hilarious. Extraordinary enemies. Holy shit, he's looking incredible. Movement and staying on the offensive, you'll find oh, a grab move? Yeah, dude. Rubicon 3 throws your way. Unreal, man. Oh my god, that, that boss looks insane. 
but all of this, like, this looks like it could be some of the best combat I've ever played. Like, what the fuck? Oh, this is incredible. Yo, if that doesn't get you hyped, I don't know what does. We're just a few hours out from launch. I can't wait, dude. I have a video discussion for AC6 that I'll leave up in the end screen, but if you're feeling the vibe, go ahead and subscribe. We'd love to have you on board. I'll be doing a ton of AC6 and catch all you guys on release. Good luck.